Hello everyone. Welcome to Brownware Animation. For details, you can check out the description of this video and Brownware Animation website. So, let's start learning small things to achieve big goals. This video we are going to look at the six must-do steps in ZBrush for beginners and these steps are followed by me in my other videos also and I think these steps will definitely help the beginner artist to start sculpting something in ZBrush. So the first step is hiding the light box. Whenever you open the ZBrush, you will get this kind of light box. You can choose the project from here, but I don't recommend that thing. You can hide it from the hide button or the comma key on your, on your keyboard. Then next step is going to the simple brush icon. Click on the simple brush icon. Then third step is choosing any 3D mesh which is available here. I always choose Sphere 3D. Then the fourth step is drag it on the canvas. Then fifth step is going to the edit button or you can press T button on your keyboard. Whenever you press T button on your keyboard or press this edit button, you get this kind of line surrounding your 3D mesh. This indicates that you are in the edit mode. Then first actually start sculpting on this mesh. You have to make it a polymesh 3D. This is the most important step. The last step which is make polymesh 3D. When you click this mesh, you will see the menu icon will, uh, the different menus will change and you can start sculpting on the mesh. And some bonus steps are, if you want to change the brush, other brush, you can go to this brush icon. You can choose any brush you want. For example, move brush. Then if you want to change the material, you can go to the material icon and choose like matte gap gray. And if you want to change the brush size, you can press S key on a keyboard. More future step is you can go to the geometry icon and you can divide your mesh for getting more resolution. But this is more of a future step. For now, you can um, keep those six steps in mind to get started in ZBrush. For other information, you can check out the description of this video. Thanks for watching the full video. See you soon in the next video.